I'm William Rondo, president of Global Concierge Services. People in the league refer to me as the plug, the connect. Um, I'm the guy you call when you need things done. My younger brother is John Rondo, point guard for the Los Angeles Lakers. How did you get picked by the NBA to basically be the concierge service of the bubble? I actually got a chance to um, develop a relationship with Michelle Roberts. She's always an advocate for players, experience, making sure they're taken care of. And I found out that there was possible locations for a bubble. I sent her an email with about 20 things that I can do, and one of them was grooming, barbers, uh, barbers in the bubble. So when I came up with that idea, uh, I knew that if you look good, you feel good. And when you feel good, you play good. What are all the services that you offer in the bubble? Haircuts, uh, we offer manicure and pedicures, twist services like uh, styling braids, locks, dreads, things of that nature. How many barbers are there? So there's actually six barbers. Um, and how many barber shops? Ooh, four barber shops. We got recommendations from players that uh, send me names of their barbers and, and things that they would like to come into the bubble. Let me write, day and night. Appreciate you, Willie Will. Guys, you know, with locks and dreads, sent me their twist specialist. It was like a draft for uh, master barbers and groomers. Yeah, I've been chosen to be a part of the NBA bubble. I am one of six barbers that have been chosen. How do you schedule everything on a daily basis with the players? Players can text uh, a designated number and call um, pretty much any time during the day and uh, try to make sure that I can be flexible enough for their practice schedules and win their games. So, you know, I have the barbers and, and groomers come in early Saturday mornings to late Sunday nights. Um, you know, pretty much seven days a week they're available. The property we are on right now actually has a glass barber shop. Can you talk about how that was developed? The NBA is uh, always looking to outdo themselves. They wanted to make sure the players had uh, an exclusive feel of a barbershop back home air conditioned, barber stations, lights, uh, TV, uh, and it's, it's right there in the middle of campus so everyone can see it. Barbershop is a place where uh, players can relax, uh, can talk stuff, uh, laugh about you know the days and things that have happened, and we want to make sure they have that experience here. So the barbershop they built on campus uh, is an amazing replica of what a barbershop would be like at home. When the hairstylists leave, the manicurist, what do you hope that they gain from this historical experience? You know, a lot of our barbers started from humble beginnings, worked their way up with just a love and a passion for what they do. To be a part of something that's bigger than themselves, to be able to, to know that providing experience is, is something that's going to make the NBA thrive and last, is something that we're all being proud of. Thank you, sir. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.